Mastering the track pattern in your Chromebook is essential if you're going to get the most value out of it. In addition to some of the basics, I'm going to show you some advanced things that you can do with your trackpad. The first and uh, probably most common thing that you'll do on your Chromebook is just a regular uh, click. And um, on, it varies a little bit, but on most Chromebooks, um, you'll press slightly on the trackpad, just anywhere on the device, doesn't matter where, and that is a left click. Usually you hear it click or kind of feel it press, and that will um, select whatever uh, you've clicked on. So that's your traditional left click. Now, uh, some students will struggle with the concept of right clicking on a Chromebook, and it is a little bit different. Um, what you need to do is take two fingers and press with those two fingers at the same time on your screen. Um, right clicking on a Chromebook will bring up you know, various different menu options depending on what you click on. So if I right click on the shelf at the bottom of the screen, it'll bring up options for configuring the shelf. If I right click in my Google Doc right here, it'll bring up options for Google Docs. So one finger for a left click, two fingers for a right click. Now another very useful thing to do on your Chromebook is um, scrolling. And so I'm in a Google Doc right now, and if I just take two fingers, lightly place them on the trackpad, and drag them up and down, I'm able to scroll on the page that I'm currently viewing. Now within the settings for your Chromebook, you can adjust the scroll direction of your device. So I have mine set up for what's called Australian mode, which means when I drag down, the document uh, actually scrolls up. So this is actually the same as it is on your iPhone when you press the screen. Feel free to adjust the scroll direction according to your own taste. Another thing that you can do in a Chromebook that is not as well known is to take three fingers and to lightly swipe them left or right on your trackpad. This will op uh, switch between your open Chrome tabs. So as I'm scrolling um, now left, it's switching to several different Chrome tabs. It's a little touchy. This isn't one that I use regularly, but it's interesting uh, to know that you can do that. A final thing that you can do with your trackpad is if you take your three fingers and slide them from the bottom to the top on your device, it opens up uh, what we've uh, come to know as um, window overview mode, uh, same as when you press the switcher key. So it displays all the different um, apps and windows that I have open. And then if I take my fingers and um, swipe them down from top to bottom, then I can go into whichever window that I've selected. So again, you slide up with three fingers and then back down with three fingers. Those are some standard gestures that are available for Chrome OS.